Hello everyone. Today I would like to simulate tensile testing with pre-pow max. Tensile specimen DIM 50125, material steel S355J2, material data on dimension of specimen you can see here. First I create part in CID, it is mine solid. I use sketch to imprint lines to surface from my boundary conditions later in FAM model. Select body on sketch with a command slice to compound imprint the lines. You can see the surface is cut. Export CID to step file. and open new project in Prepomax. Import step file. To first create meshing. Global meshing parameter with a max element size 4 mm and min element size 0.25 mm. For first calculation I will use 8 node brick elements. It is element first order. After this create extrude conditions for mesh. With 2D algorithm for quads and recombine algorithm blows up. Number of extrude elements 4. Preview. You can see surface mesh. And finally I define the refinement for middle surface with 1 mm. Preview. Create my mesh. Mesh is finished. I change element tube for first calculation to C3D8I element. Information on description of brick elements you can find in Calculix user manual chapter 6.2.3. In the video description you can find the chapters by user manual for additional information. The next step Air to define FAM model, create element Z, all elements. Now I need two reference points. Reference point 1 for fixed side, position X minus 10 mm and Z 4 mm. And reference point 2 opposite for displacement with coordinate X 217 mm and Z 4 mm. To material, you can create material directly in, in pre max or import from input file. I import my material from input file. Units in my material called are Newton, meter and kilogram and uh, Prepom Max recalculated it in new millimeter on tone. Here you can see material with plastic curve. I check units because my model in Prepom Max is in millimeter tone and second and material input file is in meter newton kilogram. Also Prepom Max recalculated it correct. After this define solid section with material all elements Next step, constraints. Rigid body 1, connections between ref reference point 1 and fixed grip section. Select surfaces from spacemen. Uh, 
in the in the same way create rigid body 2 with a reference point 2 for moving grip section Define step static. Tube automatic with time period 1 second on initial time 0 0.02. OK. History output. Displacement U and reaction force for reference point 1 and reference point 2. Element output, stress and strain. PEEQ, it is equivalent plastic strain. Boundary conditions. Reference point 1 is fixed. And I move reference point 2 30 mm in x direction. Save my model and start calculation. Results, stress, misses. Plot reaction force. Now I go back to my model and change element tube to C3D8. It is simple brick element. Save my model. And start new calculation. Analysis 2. Results, deformation on reaction force is a difference to first calculation. And finally, I test 20 node brick elements, C3D20. It is element second order with between nodes. Change of element order, I go to mesh parameter and change element order to second. You can see elements are C3T20. Save my model. Create new analysis case, analysis 3, and run simulation again. Of course, simulation with element second order need more time. 
I also compare time in the end of this video. Result, deformation, stress on the reaction force. I save all reaction forces X in Excel file and create engineering stress strain curve. Engineering strain is defined as the change in the length divided by the original length. On stress is reaction force divided initial cross section area. And comparison of process time. In conclusion is comparison of stress misses. That was for today. Goodbye.